almost can't believe it, but it's the 18th of December today. We're six days away from Christmas. I'm doing my makeup. I feel like this is the most tired I've looked all the way through December. <laughs> I wanted to show you my favorite color from the Beauty, Beauty and the Beast, the eyeshadow palette I unpacked in one of my Vlogmas episodes. Because by now I do have a few favorites in this one. I actually do like this more than Cinderella, which is not good since I'm a Cinderella girl. But I have really loved some of the golden colors in this one. There is Lumiere and Ballroom and Mrs. Potts. These ones are so beautiful and very much like my tones. I would like to try some of these more crazy colors at some point. There we go. And then I'm going to put a dark brown eyeliner on top. But I do need a mirror for that. <laughs> I'm just going to touch up the eyeshadow. Careful. And then I just need the mascara. I need a mirror for that too. <laughs> If you happen to be thinking that my outfit is quite boring, then just wait and see because I do have what I think is a good idea. I don't know how easy it is to see, but I trimmed my tips this morning. So they should now be a little bit more fresh and healthy. And now it is time to get started on the fun details for today's look. I now gonna try to turn this boring all black outfit a little more festive so we're gonna start with a red lip I love a red lip for Christmas this is my favorite red lipstick and it's Kat Von D and it's the color shade Outlaw I also like Lolita but this is Outlaw can I do this in a viewfinder <laughs> Oh, I just need, I just need my calm because I want a very sleek bun today and a great help is definitely to use a calm. I want to wear some very festive earrings. I think these are so beautiful. They're made by a small Swedish artist. I've now listed them on the webshop. So when you buy these, you're not only supporting my small business, but you're also supporting a small Swedish artist. So I think that's really lovely and I love them. I think they're so beautiful. There we go. Starting to get festive. I'm gonna put on some rings, all from the webshop. I think that's really important when I'm working in the weekends. Today is the last opening day of 2021. So I wanna wear stuff that is from the boutique. This ring has been my favorite lately. Where am I gonna wear you? I'm gonna wear you here and then not this one. And that's the ring look of the day. And then to the last bit because royalty kimonos are back in stock and of course I fell in love with one too. So I want to wear that one today and I want to show you how I think it's really lovely to style them for like an everyday outfit. So I'm just wearing all black and then I'm going to pop the kimono on top. Isn't she lovely? Isn't she wonderful? I'm either going to wear her with this string or I'm going to wear her with a belt. I just need to see. I'm going to go with the belt today because it makes it even more a part of the outfit. And it's so pretty. These kimonos are like, by the way, they're one of a kind. They're made of recycled material. So there is only one of each. Completely fell in love with this one. So this is the outfit of the day. I think it's really pretty and festive. So on the rating from 1 to 10 that I haven't used much. Um, I'm going to give my outfit of the day an 8 out of 10. 
this is how my desk goes from tidy to terrible in just a few days because I pretty much just throw everything here after I've been getting ready and then I forget to tidy. So we're just gonna do that. For my perfume of the day, I'm gonna use this one. I completely lost track of time. I've just been very productive. I had 20 minutes. I managed to shoot eight royalty kimonos that I'm gonna put up on Bohemian Wonders Instagram story, maybe in the feed too today. Beautiful. I think those were the last ones before Christmas. But these are gorgeous. Look at this one. Beautiful. I've been meaning to get this done for such a long time. It feels really lovely to finally get the shoes that we use for photo shoots up there. The cart to where I've shipped. I just added this one the other day. Argentina. Amazing. So that looks lovely. I love this look. That's great. Proud of myself. blow it out for the last time before Christmas I'm gonna turn off the lamps close down oh I should empty the fitting room but I don't feel like it right now because we're a little bit in a hurry I need to go out and get the last Christmas presents I think I'm gonna bring my small Christmas tree with me home because why not put it in my living room for the next week or so and then I need to, a place to plant it out maybe around the cabin I've come out to Genkoselane where I used to work actually if you haven't watched my channel for a long time I worked here two years ago I think when I started out being self-employed I had hours here every single week so we're gonna head in and see if we can find something actually particularly for my boyfriend um, so if you're watching Stop the video. <laughs> I saw this beautiful embroidered stall the moment I walked into the boutique and I can just envision it in the cabin, kitchen. So I really kept that in mind while walking through the boutique looking for presents. I saw this one which is actually on my boyfriend's wish list, not in this color scheme but still retro and they're really hard to find. And then I saw this spot in the boutique with vintage dresses. They're really old historical pieces. And I thought these were quite fun Christmas decor. 
I was just looking through the dresses but I think they were too expensive considering the condition of them. I was looking at this lamp and it was so beautiful but it was almost 2000 Danish kroner which is madness I think. Another chandelier, but in a cold tone. I like them to be golden. And then I thought this bag was really pretty, but it was also very expensive. But it's beautiful. This is usually my favorite corner of the boutique. And it used to be full of 70s pots and cups and plates, all in orange tones. But it was not super interesting today, I must admit. This lamp was so beautiful. Look at the pearls coming down from it. It was also pretty expensive. And if I had a beautiful home and a place for it, it would be something I would consider. So I got a present. Took a chance with this one. Because I know that he would like something to put bread in. Not exactly this color, but it's really hard to find. So I think this is pretty nice. And then I got this one for the cabin. So beautiful. I couldn't leave it behind. So gorgeous. We've made it to the chaos. This is where all of the cars are and all of the people. They're here shopping for Christmas presents. That was so chaotic and warm because it's too cold to not wear a coat outside. It's too warm to wear both a coat and a face mask inside. I got a Vecchi calzone. I always do that when I'm in Ikea. I got a present. have one thing left that I would like to find. But then I need to walk to the center over there. And there are just so many people that I'm afraid I'm just gonna walk into a chaos. Mmm, it's warm. Mm. I love these, so simple. Oh, there's a lot of beans. fries mm. I have salad in one side of my plate and fries in the other and I've put on my favorite Christmas film Elf oh It's not even late but when we've opened up the calendars I just want to take off my makeup go sit in the sofa and look like a zombie for the rest of the night and I still have a few hours to like watch movies and chill it's only eight o'clock so let's scratch the calendar we also need 17 from yesterday two more reindeers guys to win 5,000 and I would love to win 5,000 <laughs> 17 a drum 18 a reindeer oh a drum we got a drum and a reindeer oh no this is gonna get interesting we only need one star for 50 Danish corner we do not want to win that that's the price of one of these if we get the drums, we can win 1,000, and if we get reindeers, we can win 5,000. We have a vitamin in rin enriched face base. 
I'm learning so much this month. To me, this it smells like <laughs> just like a face cream, and it looks like a face cream. But it says vitamin face base. So to the body shop. Da 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 da. Have we opened 17? Nope. We have them right here next to each other. 17 and 18. In 17, we have the British Rose Exfoliating Gel Body Scrub. And I love the rose scent. Mm. It's divine. But I actually usually give these to my mom because she really likes the smell of these. And I must admit, I'm too lazy to use a face scrub or a body scrub. My mom likes to do that. So I think I'm going to give it to her. And I could just wrap it up for Christmas. <laughs> Number 18 is a mango hand cream small handy one that you can keep in your purse and bring with you that's great i always have a hand cream in my bag but i never really use it i'm just so bad <laughs> um yeah that was the last opening day in 2021 it feels i don't know i don't think it's sinking in yet that in a couple of days i'm actually going to slow down over christmas and new year's it's going to be really good for me i've had a few years if we look back where by the time that i made it to christmas time i had been so drained that i got sick from it um and it is chaotic december is a crazy month and Deciding to do block mess on top of everything else is a little bit extreme. So I also need to say that there will pro pro probably not be a block mess out every single day until Christmas from now on. Tomorrow I'm going to spend with my boyfriend. Um, we have decided that we're going to take like 24 hours just like him and I trying to just slow down and do things at the pace that we want to do it and like do whatever we want to also Denmark is closing down from tomorrow theaters like the cinema bars so many things are going to either close completely or like close super early so things are gonna be shut down a lot more from tomorrow and I think we're just going to enjoy that together, me and my boyfriend, and spend some quality time together. Because it's also been hectic, like, seeing each other throughout December. Um, so, I won't promise a video every single day for the remaining until, this, oh, until Christmas Eve. I will try my best to film some bits and pop it out when I can. But I have posted so many videos in December and if you haven't seen all of them you can go back and have a look um yeah I hope that you understand that um yeah I need to just like slow down a little bit <laughs> or I'll be sick for Christmas Eve thank you guys so much for watching today leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed it of course and thank you so much to all of you who popped over on my Instagram and showed me some love. <laughs> that means a lot. That was very sweet of you. So I'm going to see you all soon. Won't promise when, but I will post some more content before Christmas Eve, I promise. So see you all soon. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.